The play stick out of the West Coast Gun Bunch formation is one of the best quick snap plays in Madden 24. Now, if you're watching this video and you want to get my entire West Coast offensive ebook, join the Patreon today for just 10 bucks. It's going to get you access to all of my Madden offensive and defensive ebooks. And we're dropping brand new ebooks pretty much every day. We've already dropped 12 ebooks for Madden 24, and we're going to be dropping more ebooks later today. So if you're not a member yet, make sure you sign up. You also get access to all of the updates to those ebooks as long as your membership is active. So for just 10 bucks, I think it's a great way to improve your Madden game. Now, from a setup perspective, we're only going to need one hot route. All we're going to do is we're going to fade the slot receiver and we're going to snap the ball. And what you're going to see here is you've got a couple different reads in terms of how this play is going to work. If they are running man-to-man -man coverage on you, one of my favorite things to do is to look to this sharp cutting corner route. And as you can see, he'll cut sharply to the side. Now, another little thing you can do for fun if you want to is you can put the tight end on a zig. I'll show you that this tight end whip will beat man-to-man. -man. It is a little bit more of a setup, but tight end zigs are pretty good against man coverage. Now, as you see right here, um, sometimes the random bumping can kind of uh, just, I don't know, mess with the play. But the main route on the play is this corner route to the right side. And so what you want to do is you want to freeform outside and basically freeform it to the sideline. Um, so essentially, you're trying to get it out there. Not quite that far, <laughs> um, but basically this this sharp cutting corner route, one of the best plays in the game this year for beating man. You want to almost throw it almost like a more rounded back shoulder out route type of route, especially against man to man. It's a little better against press man, but you see there, there's that sharp cut and we're able to beat the man coverage. I'll show you it real quick against like a more of a two man under look that, um, that you might see. So something like this where they're pressing you on the outside and they have some safety help. The beauty of this corner route is it cuts so, sh so sharply, and it can typically really get you some nice separation against man coverage regardless of your ratings, okay? Uh, so we have some nice man beaters, obviously, the slant backside. Another thing I want to quickly point out, let's say your opponent's sending five-yard blocking your running backs, so you're going to have some time. This uh, fade route and this tight end flat. So the tight end flat is really good against cover zero because the safeties in this game – they don't really get out there to play man coverage well on uh, flat routes and quick hitting routes like that. Another reason why this play is really good, though, is you have this backside slant that pretty much always beats man to the inside. So you have a lot of good reads against man coverage with this play. And let's talk about this play as it pertains to zone. So one of the really cool things about stick is it's one of the only plays from a compression formation where it has this sharp cutting corner route that is going to get open against cover four drop or cover three. So even though cover four drop and cover three normally will guard uh, corner routes to the wide side of the field, they're not going to be able to defend this corner route because it is so sharp and it cuts so sharply to the sideline. So as you can see right here, it's going to be wide open. Obviously, you don't want to throw the ball out of bounds. It's hilarious that I didn't pass lead that whatsoever and uh, still got uh, shamed by the AI. Probably the adaptive AI got me there again. But you see here, I mean, it's just wide open. Uh, this simple, short, sharp cutting corner route against cover three and cover four. Now, uh, let's talk about cover two drop. So a couple things about cover, cover two that you want to know about this play. First things first is when you run this to the wide side of the field, you can sometimes free for this streak and get you a one play score if they're playing traditional cover two, even if they have match on. So as you saw right there, like just a simple streak, if you know it's cover two, is actually really good because this streak can sometimes get you some separation um, up the up the seam. Now, right there, wasn't able to get it. Okay, so it's one of those things where you got to read the middle linebacker. If the middle linebacker matches him, then he matches him, and you got to move on. But if he doesn't match him, you might have a shot. Now, let's talk about this corner route and flat. So the first things first is this flat route. These cloud flats really don't play the flats well this year at all. So if they're in a true cover two or Tampa two. Please look to hit this flat route. It's pretty good. And again, all you're trying to do is just take what the defense gives you. They're playing clouds on the outside. I'm going to take my five yards. Then what they'll do is they'll play hard flats. Now, um, I want to show the corner route real quick against cloud flatted cover two. Against cloud flatted cover two, you can really free form and up. But as you see there, like it's not super open against this defense. Now, if you're first and 10, you can smart route the stick route. So if you wanted to run a little deeper, you can smart route it 
and you'll see it'll get up field a little bit more and it will get over the top of the cloud and into that soft spot against that zone coverage. Another thing you can do is audible to corner strike. If you know they are in cover two, you can just audible to corner strike and it has a deeper corner route, which is what makes West Coast Bunch so good that will get over the top of that cloud flat, okay? My recommendation would be just take what the deep blitz gives you and take the tight end flat. If they are playing hard flats on the outside, even if they're playing soft squats, this corner route you'll see will get open and you'll be able to throw this up the, ski, up the sideline just like that. This forces them to have to have some type of double flat coverage on the bunch side and they can't rely on the third, which is the real big piece of this. So they really have to make it look like this, which if you think about it, what this does, it opens up the entire left-hand side and middle of the formation for our other routes in the offense. And of course, don't feel uh, afraid to throw that streak if you can see that angle or in that window to hit it up the seams. Guys, stick is a really, really good play this year. Um, it's probably even better than it was last year. This corner route is super consistent against man coverage. Please, if you are struggling to beat man consistently, if you're struggling to beat cover four consistently, if you're struggling on offense this year, join the Patreon. That's where you'll get access to the whole ebook where we don't only break down stick, but we break down the entire West Coast bunch. And by being a Patreon member, you get access to all of our ebooks. So you get ebooks like Trips Tied In, ebooks like U Trips, ebooks like Tight Slots, Bunch Offset, um, all of that stuff. Everything's included. Offense, defensive ebooks, 10 bucks. Join the Patreon today by heading down to the description and clicking the link down below.